Center Coast Living is the GOAT. Translation, greatest of all time. That's why I decided to visit a goat farm and creamery tucked away in San Simeon. These friendly little goats are just the warm-up for visitors to Stepladder Ranch and Creamery. She's a teenager. You know, they're about like nine to ten weeks old. And you really can't get enough of them. They're so cute. So these were all born anywhere from two to five months ago, so they're all still very young. The rural San Simeon Ranch offers tours. First, you meet some of the 70 goats who live here. Take some photos, indulge in goat cuddles, all while learning about the working animals. Goats are browsers, so more like deer where they eat up high. They'll eat like Owner Michelle Rudolph wants to give visitors an educational and fun experience. You really get to learn what a princess dairy goat looks like um, and support a really small business. Second goat will come over, turn her head down, opens up third spot. Step into the milking stand and see where the goats go to work. So they definitely have a hierarchy and they'll kind of vie for for a first slot in the milking stand over there. Then watch the cheesemakers work their magic, turning goat's milk into all this. First cheese we're gonna try is our Paso Vino. Followed by a cheese tasting. So this is a really firm cheese. It's kind of cool that the cheese is sold literally a foot away from where it's made. A true farm to table experience in our own backyard. You can find Stepladder Creamery goat cheese at many of our local farmers markets. And if you want to take a tour, book online. We have a link to do that at ksby.com. So is it delicious? It's so good. They sent me home with a little bit of cheese and it is Ugh. really, really yummy. I still have another one I'm waiting to dig it into. <laughs> Maybe sharing. That'd be nice. Okay, I'll bring it in tomorrow. <laughs> it looked great. It is so good. Yeah, definitely a good thing to do over the weekend. How's weather looking as